Naltuk? Who are you? How did you find me? Burgrind told me you'd be out here. He's persistent. I've told that Asaram a thousand times. I don't need to buy anything. And I'm not selling. I just need to find Aurea. Well, you won't. She's gone where only shamans can tread. She seeks guidance from the voice in the blue light. That is her task. And the task she gave me is to observe the daemon's work. To stop it spreading, if I can. What can I do about these towers? In only a few weeks, they've sprouted throughout the cut. The daemon's energy pulses from them. Rallies the machines, even repairs them. Aratok said this daemon was... frenzying machines? Look there. Those with the purple markings. They belong to the daemon. They're stronger, more dangerous. I've seen something like this before. Corruption. But it wasn't from your daemon. You have? Well, then you know more than I do. These towers, were they part of your corruption? No. Those are new to me, too. Like I said, they empower the daemon's machines. They must be stopped. Will you tell me where Aurea went? You ask a lot of questions. Only when I'm not getting the answers I need? There's but one voice Aurea wants to hear right now, and it isn't yours. I'm sorry. All right. You want to stop the spread of the Daemon's work? I know how to get started. With my bow and spear. Outlander, wait! Won't you tell me your name? Aloy. Good. If you fall to the Daemon's machines, at least I can properly recount your efforts to Aurea. Thanks for the vote of confidence. But I won't fall. And when I'm done, you're gonna tell me where she is. 